sharing an email with your ex. I would rather pluck my fingernails out with my own teeth than to share an email address that we both have access to, we both have to agree on a password, and we both get to communicate to the teacher using it. No. No. This may be great for those parents that live in the same neighborhood as each other, that still do Christmas together, that fucking do weekly dinners. But for high conflict, it's a no. Because here are the things that I see happening. Number one, my ex would change the password to send a shitty email about me. Number two, my ex would lie and say that they didn't send the email, that it came from my... And then I'd have to hire attorneys to look at IP addresses. It, no. Number three... The teacher would never really truly know who is sending stuff. Because I can put his name on and act like he sent it. It's just messy for me. So for all of you parent coordinators out there, stop recommending this to clients. We're grown-ass adults. You have your email address. I have mine. We do not need to be a united front. Because here's the other fucking like comment. Um, married couples don't share an email with the teacher. There's a mom email and a dad email or however your family dynamic. It's a no for me. You're creating more conflict by doing that. Okay. 